Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. So every time you tap an app, scroll aside or switch to dark mode, someone has actually written the code for it. That someone is a front-end developer. But what exactly is front-end development in 2025? Is it still a good career? Or is AI killing it? Can you do it? Let's break it all down. No fluff, just facts. So let's see what is front-end development. Front-end development is all about what users see and interact with. Buttons, layouts, animations, dark mode toggles, the whole vibe. But it wasn't always this slick. Back in the early web days, it was mostly just HTML, basic texts and links. Then came CSS, and suddenly we had colors, layouts, and styles. Then JavaScript entered the chat and made pages interactive, drop-down sliders, pop-ups. Fast forward to now, and we have got frameworks like React, Vue, and Angular that make building app faster, cleaner, and way more powerful. Okay, but is front-end still worth learning in 2025? 100%. You have got AI writing code, but design thinking and building dope user experiences still superhuman. There is Web3, SaaS, mobile-first, accessibility, so much is there. And the demand for front-end developers who get users is still high. And with tools like React.js, Redux, and AI co-pilots, front-end is evolving fast. If you love creative tech, fast feedback loops, and building stuff people actually touch, this path is for you. Career path and roadmap, here's how the career path typically flows as a front-end developer. When you're new, you'll be joining as junior front-end developer, where you'll be coding layouts, fixing bugs, and learning it. Then comes the mid-level, here you own features, collaborate with designers, optimize performance, etc. Then comes the senior or lead, where you'll be mentoring the team, you'll be creating architectures, there will be DevOps, even product decisions will be taken. And not just this, you can also branch into UI UX design. You can be a mobile app developer. You can go into full stack development. And there's also a stream called product engineer, where you have mixing roles, like you'll be mixing codes, plus product thinking, etc. And let's be real, it doesn't stop here. There are remote jobs, you will be doing freelance gigs and indie hacking are very much possible if you learn front-end. So is front-end development right for you? Ask yourself, do you love visual stuff and user experience? Do you enjoy turning designs into live products? Can you handle debugging CSS at 2 a.m.? If yes, then front-end might be your thing. It's perfect for developers who want creative freedom and technical challenge. So you wanna start today? Here's the 2025 game plan. Learn HTML, CSS, JavaScript. The basics still matter. Pick a framework. Let me tell you, React is the GOAT. Build projects, real ones, landing pages, dashboards, and clone. Learn Git and GitHub. On top of it, leverage the use of generative AI to develop interactive and proficient web apps. Just a bonus tip. Use AI wisely, let it assist you, not replace you. So final words from my end, front-end development in 2025 is creative, in demand, and is evolving fast. If you vibe with both tech and design, this might be your call. And if you're serious about leveling up, please check out our course on Coding Ninjas. I have taught you from basic to advanced front-end. It's beginners friendly, mentor-backed, and built for real-world skill. For more details, Please join our webinar, link is in the description. Catch you in the next one, thank you.